fighting for space with the grill are all these sensors that we put on the front of the vehicle. Um, act active parking, park assist sensors, uh, long range radar for active crews, infrared sensors and so forth. And each one of those sensors has a, a cone uh, that has to be unobstructed. So the front of the car is filled with all these sensors and cooling requirements and impact requirements. And um, in, in a lot of ways, it's, it's shaping the topography of the front end of the car. So designing around all those and still capturing the brand character, the brand essence, is, is a challenge for us, for we designers. In the pursuit of vehicle efficiency, it's a trade-off. It depends how how pricey the car is. You know, if you're doing something like a Cadillac, you may be able to take mass out of the vehicle by paying for uh, lightweight materials. Um, something like a Chevrolet, you may not have that luxury, so you may go after aerodynamic performance. Well, there's the infotainment, right? I mean, you know. The customer is expecting the interior of their car to do more and more and more, and, and all these uh, components need to be within reach curves. You have to be able to, to see them and touch them and so forth, and then packaging of airbags and so forth for safety. So the inside of the car, in many ways, is even more challenging than the outside of the car because the customer is demanding that the car do so much for them.